Hello friends, Tony here. So here I am in the dashboard and in this video I want to create a controllers for the event and the gallery because for event and gallery we are going to have CRUD here and create a routes and add the link for events and the galleries here and also create the pages for CRUD for event and for the gallery. So first let's open the terminal and here I'm going to create the controller so artisan make controller and the name of the controller is going to be event controller and also is going to be resource okay and the same is going to be for the gallery controller like this okay Today's video is brought to you by Cloudways, a managed cloud hosting platform for PHP based applications. So we have WordPress, Magento, Laravel and PHP. Cloudways takes over all server management and security hassles to let you solely focus on your business. Their custom stack provides performance boost, managed backups that keep your app safe and a staging environment that let you test code without breaking live sites. Plus, pre-configured Composer and integrated GI make deployments a breeze and you get a choice between five top cloud providers including DigitalOcean, Vulture, Linode, WSL and GCI. With Cloudways, you not only get flexibility but peace of mind. So if you are an agency or an e-commerce store owner, Cloudways is a great fit for all your managed hosting requirements. Don't forget to use promo code link in description. Now let's open the VS Code. Sorry, the VS Code here. And let's open the web routes. So let's open the web routes and register the routes here. Here on the group for the Profiles. I'm going to add also the route to be resource for the events and here use the event controller so event controller class okay and also the gallery so route resource and galleries and here use the gallery controller okay now we are good we created these two routes now let's open the navigation because as i said i want to have the links here so let's open the navigation navigation blade inside the resources views layouts and here when we have the dashboard which is this one this link i'm going to copy and paste two times one is for the event index so let's say events dot index and the name is going to be events and the second one is going to be for the galleries.index and the name also here is going to be uh, galleries or gallery you can say it like this now let's save this and let's see now if I refresh yeah we have the event and the gallery here if I click right now yeah we have a blank page so let's fix that let's open the controller now the, the event controller and on the index right now I'm just going to return the view so return the view and the view is going to be inside the events dot index okay let's say also here is going to return the view from the illuminate view here save and let's create now the folder events folder and the index blade so let's navigate inside the resources views and here first create 
the events folder and then the index.blade.php. Okay, now I'm going to go in the dashboard and select what we have here, copy and paste it right here. The head show is going to be events and then instead of the login here is going to be the table so i'm going to say just table right now let's save and let's see if i navigate the events yeah as you can see here is a table okay let's do the same thing for the gallery so let's open the gallery controller and here I'm going to return the view and I'm going to create galleries uh, galleries folder and then the index blade let's save this let's close for now everything and let's go inside the views create the galleries folder and then inside create the index blade so index.blade.php let's navigate in the dashboard again and copy what we have here paste it right here and say galleries and then also here is going to be the table refresh navigate the gallery now and yeah here is going to be the table okay friends this is the short video for today i hope you enjoy and now let's start and work with the crowd for events and the gallery in the next video all the best